Hello my angel babies, so I'm coming at you with another video. Now, I have the Knight of Cups clarified by the Hierophant. So this is, I want to say like an apology coming in, but it's like a love offering coming in, okay, possibly from a Taurus, doesn't have to be. But it's like from a prince charming, like from somebody that's like trying to charm you or trying to do something of that sort. Okay, and this person is a Taurus. Yeah, this person does not like rejection, okay? And they have the courage right now to do this. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm seeing that. Now, the next part, what's in your current energy? So, this could have already happened, but, like, what's in your current energy is the King of Pentacles, and we have the Six of Pentacles. So, this person wants to have an exchange with you, okay? They want to talk to you about something, okay? Possibly money, Try to give you options for money. Okay, or maybe this person is trying to charm you for your money. Okay, I don't know. Yeah, we have wealthy man here. And we also have the lover. So, this person wants to offer you their love. They're a wealthy man. Okay. Now, the next part of your reading, we have the devil and the five of cups, but it's going to be a trap, okay? I feel like this offer turns into something that has you, like, tied down, that has you feeling like, like you can't move, you know? It just has you feeling very stuck, very bound, and it's going to make you feel really, really sad. Yeah, we have sudden change, shocking news, surprise, upheaval, transformation, and we have the runner. So you could also be dealing with a Capricorn. You could be dealing with a Capricorn or a Taurus, but somebody is not showing you their hand, okay? Somebody, somebody gambled with you or is gambling with you. So you may not be the only one, okay? Or you could find out that you're going to be cheated on or have been cheated on or something like that. Okay. Yeah, we have concealment. So right now you may not know about this, but this is what's going to get ready to come out is that somebody abandoned you in the relationship by cheating on you. We also have prosperity, but you have prosperity coming in. That's what they don't see, okay, is that you have prosperity coming in, and you're going to have a homeland or a foundation, okay? So, Your ancestors want to tell you something, watch the signs. So there's going to be signs that this person is going to display. They're going to let you know that they're not serious, okay? That they're taking everything as a joke. That they're not serious about everything. Like, they don't want to come across as somebody that's, like, trying to, like, lock you down. They're going to try and joke with you or something um, and try and, like, lighten the mood, they're going to be doing things, like, out of the norm. Okay, trying to get your attention, okay? And keep in mind, like, this is... This person is a lying scammer. Don't believe anything that they say. Watch their actions. Yeah, your ancestors are telling you to watch the signs. And 
and <laughs> you have this person is a lying scammer watch the action so somebody's trying to scam you using your love okay they're trying to offer you up like maybe like love bomb you so that they don't get rejected and trying to tell you that they're like wealthy or something like that but really they're just after whatever prosperity it is that you have we have spell work was done but failed to work completely so this person may have even tried to cast spell work on you um, this person is bound by witchcraft, root magic, not their own, acting on their own. Yeah, this person definitely tried to, like, get you to, like, succumb to their will, okay? Um, but really, if you did get with this person, you would just be trading your emotional, you know, and mental well-being for, like, materialistic stuff. So, you know, ask yourself if it's worth all of that just to, you know be with somebody we also have personal issue reaches a resolution so with cancer you may be sidestepping you may not be trying to deal with this situation like head on you may just be kind of going with the flow right now not trying to disturb anything too much you know like sidestepping um we have a new romantic cycle begins, new moon in Libra. So something more balanced out is going to come, okay, of this situation. So I would say let this play out. Like, if this person is going to flare, you know, just let it play out. They don't like rejection. There's no telling what this man is going to do because he's been rejected, okay? So just watch out for that. Um... Yeah, we have five of swords, so this person could definitely try to abuse you uh, verbally or mentally, um, you know, just talk down to you or talk bad on you and try to manipulate you, like, at all costs just to get what it is that you have or just to get inside your head, okay? It'll be a really, really bad relationship if you get with this person. This person will try and get you, like, love addicted to them. So maybe that's what the root work was, is that this person wants to get you love addicted to them in some type of way. Again, you could be dealing with a Taurus, could be dealing with a Capricorn. Strong Earth energy here. Could also be dealing with an Aquarius. Ah, uh, yeah. So it says, know yourself, meditate on who you are, because the veil is lifting. Okay, whatever is going on with you, it, it, it's. This is fading away, okay? The situation is just slowly fading away. So this person will fade away. You could fade the situation away if you don't want to deal with it head on. Because you never know what people are like these days. They may not appreciate, you know, um, honesty and being rejected. They may react in a certain way that you don't want them to. Okay, but this person is going to be deeply sad, deeply depressed. Okay. Um, and it's funny, though, because, like, even though this person may have cheated in the past or something like that or like been unfaithful like they're still sad about this ending like all the work that they put in which sounds stupid and crazy but I just feel the need to say that yeah like there's no new offers coming in here this person may lose a huge chunk of money and they're super duper worried about it okay they're super duper worried about this we have emperor here so you may also be dealing with an Aries but this person is so worried about this lie coming out that, like, they're just going to be so depressed. They're going to be so depressed. They're going to be so depressed. 
that's all I'm saying. But I hope that this helped you. Um, again, this is more of a things could go in different ways type of reading. Because um, I am seeing somebody who cheated in the past and now that it's over, they're going through a depression. I am also seeing somebody entering a relationship for materialistic gains and it turned out to be an abusive relationship and now it's 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 fading um i i see this reading as a bunch of different different aspects okay i also see a man here that may get played okay somebody's just with them for their finances okay somebody is just with them for their finances or there's a man here that wants to get with somebody for their finances. Switch the genders around. Take it how it resonates. But yeah. One of those type of readings. So thank you for listening. And if you made it this far. <laughs> Alright. Um, and I will see you in the next one.